Hello everyone, I am James and you are watching Good Times Tech YouTube channel. Today I will show you how I created uh, my own 3D, simple 3D logo for my YouTube branding that is transparent branding. For that just click on the start menu of your Windows 10 then click on the paint 3D. When the paint 3D opens click on the new as you can see we have a rectangle canvas here. So select crop, in crop you select a 1 is to 1 because we YouTube doesn't allow us to upload any other shape, it allows only the square image to be uploaded. Select square, then select 3D shapes as we are going to create a 3D like looking image for 3D, 2D, 2D, 2D image. So select 3d in 3d you can select either sphere say hemisphere the hemisphere or a cylinder whichever shape you want from this you can select select a 3d object that is i am in for my channel i have chosen a cube select the cube double click on the canvas okay now align it to the center increase the size okay now you can see four tabs around this cube one is for x-axis rotation one is for y-axis rotation on the left side it is z-axis position and top it is z-axis rotation so for now I have selected a square a cube now it appears to be square I need to make it appear like a cube so for that hold, press and hold the mouse click mouse button click and hold the mouse button on the y axis rotation tab turn it either right or the left side by 45 degrees okay now we can see the front part of the cube just tilt the click and hold the mouse button on the x-axis position x-axis rotation tab you can see this is x-axis rotation tab click and hold pull it downwards by 25 degrees in my case I am choosing it for 25 degrees if you want you can change to the size or the shape to be appear different kind you can change it you can rotate it by some other degrees now I will increase the size so that it will fit into the canvas properly okay see that none of the corners go beyond the canvas all the corners should be inside the canvas okay now this is about the cube and I'll change the color of the cube now for my channel I have chosen square so select a square uh, sorry for my channel I have selected cube and for the color of the cube I have selected red so select the red color on the top bar you can select material type or the appearance type that is matte gloss dull metal polished metal in this way for my logo i have chosen gloss so now this is about the color and shape of the logo which we are selected now i need to add text on that for text choose the text here select the 3d text select the font size select the font type and color of the font I will choose rose for my channel it's rose okay now click the mouse button on one side of the cube drag it and type the alphabet which you want as my channel name is good times tech I have selected GTT so G has appeared click the mouse button on outside the box of the alphabet okay 
now you can see that part of the alphabet is inside the tube so I'll, I will need to bring it out for that click and hold on the Z axis position pull it towards yourself towards the front as you can see in this way okay leave it bring it down if you want you can increase the size of the alphabet as per your preference your liking adjust the axis x y and z axis so that the alphabet appears to be sitting on the side of the cube as if it is attached attached on the cube as if it should appear like it is been attached on the cube I think G is done now. It's okay with G. Okay, G. Now I'll go for T. Select the T text tab. Type T. For second alphabet there is no need to say again change the size of the font unless and until you want it to be changed. Click outside, see the position, increase the size, adjust the x x, x y and z axis. Yeah. Here it is. As you can see here, the distance. This line is not straight. We need to align it properly.
okay now the last part for that i need to change the font size because i want to write whole tech tch on the top of the cube change the font size if you want you can select different color for all these separate item i alphabets square box and box the top and now text 3d text box select 3d text here 3d select the box type t e c h tag okay click outside Okay, increase the size. I have inclined it in such a way that it appears to be raising up tech. Okay, now I think it's well and good I need to pull it little front I think so Okay, it's done. Now the final step is select canvas and turn on the transparent canvas. If you won't select this one, a square box will appear behind the image, whether it is sphere, whether it is cylinder or cube, whatever it is. A square box will appear, white square box will appear. So now after this we need to save the image save as select image don't select 3d model or video because youtube doesn't allow us to upload those for uh, branding select image and here select png don't select jpg if you select jpg the transparency will be disappear and you will see that a white canvas or a white image is appearing on the image you have uploaded so select png and confirm that this transparency is checked now save as you can see I have tried many of the logos same thing but I have tried it different times so now I'll see in logo 11, 11. Okay, save it. done hope this video was helpful for you in creating your own simple 3d logo for your channel branding logo if this video was helpful for you and you like the video kindly hit the like icon share the video and subscribe to our channel if you have not yet subscribed thank you for watching everyone have a good time